Okay, today I'm making a video on how to uh, bleed your brakes using TechStream software. So we'll go up here, start off by going connect a vehicle, click on that, it's going to be initializing. Give it a couple minutes. There you go. So it'll just hide my VIN there, but it shows you Lexus RX 330.05 with the motor. Just on the option, just click. Uh, well, in this case, it doesn't have laser cruise, so we'll deselect that. Next. Okay, so we're going to go to where it says ABS, top one there, ABS, VSC, Vehicle Stability Control. So we'll go ahead and click on there, double click. If you're doing the VSC vehicles only, ensure it's idling. Um, we're not going to be checking the VSC, so ignition, the key's on the on position, that's about it. Please wait. Okay, so now it says diagnose diagnostic codes none. We're gonna go down here to where it says utility. Double click that. Please wait. Okay, you'll notice up here, there's an option that says air bleeding. We'll go ahead and double click that. Use this function after replacing the brake actuator. Um, I just do it whenever I want to bleed brakes because it's much easier. Welcome to the air bleeding utility. This function is used to purge. You guys could read. Make sure your master cylinder reservoir doesn't drop below. The minimum mark, otherwise you'll be redoing this and you'll have uh, much more problems. Anyways, I'm not going to go ahead and do this. Um, all I could, I did it earlier. It works super well. Um, it's easier to do it two, with two people, but it's uh, easily done at one. Just follow the steps. It's foolproof. It tells you exactly what to do. Um, I think it told me to start at the front right or rear right wheels. So essentially just hook up your vinyl tubing, open up the bleeder. Come back to your laptop, hit next. The ABS module will uh, purge that line for about four seconds. Then it tells you close the bleeder, go ahead and close it. It's really straightforward, it couldn't be any easier. Um, I got quite a bit of air out of my lines here, um, of which I didn't get out manually, like bleeding it the regular way. I uh, bled and bled for days, and uh, doing going through this process here, I got a lot more air out. So. Highly suggest doing that. Hopefully you guys enjoy this video. Uh, more to come.